Hello and welcome. My name is Gail Moffat and we have God here who wishes to bring forward some more words. I always think that uh, when God comes through, he comes through with such clarity about life and details that are so amazing. If you wish to be part of these words and, and, and understand what he has to say, don't think, and also, you know, Jesus comes through and, and angels and all sorts of people, then don't forget to subscribe so that you can always be kept abreast of what is going to be said and, and how God is, and you can also glean uh, an idea of how, how loving God is. So um, let's go to, go to God and see what he has to say. He's thanking me for, for my kind words and he says that um, he, he loves it when I um, talk about him in a loving, kind way. Uh, because he says that he is uh, a loving God and he says that he chooses always to be loving to many people um, on, on this planet um, and in his kingdom. And he says that um, he is very excited about today because he has some words that he wishes to to share with us and he feels that these words are are words that will help man understand that um, what he is doing and why he is doing this and the words today are he feels that when he observes man and observes everything that they are doing, he sees um, great achievements and great um, work that has been carried out by many people on your, on your earth. And he says that when he witnesses people who are good and loving, he always is so grateful to them and so pleased. And time and time again, when people come back to his, his earth and after a lifetime where they have been good, he always um, shows his gratitude and rewards them with so much love. And he's saying to me that for those people that have always been good and shown love to other people, he feels that they will be go moving into new territory. Whilst they complete their life, they will be um, shown to, to many people um, how giving and how loving they are. And he will be helping them express themselves in ways that they perhaps haven't thought of because they will be guided to be um, to express their words and, their, and what they are doing in their lives um, in, in ways that perhaps were not the original plan for their lives. But now he is trying to attempt to show people how many people are loving on this earth. With this new way of working for these people, he feels that it will create a lot of success because they will be shining examples, beacons of light that he always likes to see on the earth. With Gail, I have chosen to come forward and give her my words and I speak through her um, as, I am, as, I, as I am today. And he says that with all my words, it is important that people understand that I do this for a, a particular reason. And the reason is that I wish for man to be more elevated, come to a greater source of light and come to back to my world, having achieved such great things. For if people can achieve great things, they will achieve things that, that they will go on to achieve things that will be greater even more. Because when someone comes back to my world that have, has achieved great things, I always say to them, I would like you to do more great work. 
I would like you to help me in my kingdom or I would like, like you to help me and return back to the earth so that you can help mankind in a way that perhaps you haven't considered. And this is something that is open to you because God is watching and observing all of our lives. He understands the difficulties we are having and he understands how difficult sometimes it is to help someone when there is someone in need. Today, he feels gratified, gratified that he can speak his words and gratified that, he, that many people can come forward and help him in the work that needs to be done. As we move forward in this new way of working, he feels that we will have an army of people, people that are surrounded by light, people that have had gu specific guides placed beside them, people that will be showing to many others that they are good, they are with God, and God is with them. This is the new way of being. The light is descending upon your earth and surrounding you and surrounding the earth. The angelic realm is my support and comes with me. The Holy Spirit is always with me and through me. Today, we are experiencing a new way of living and this is how it works with love. Always, always with love. I thank you for hearing my words and listening to me today. I thank all of mankind for choosing the path of light. I thank them for always caring for their neighbour, loving each other and sharing what is needed to be shared. I believe that in time more people will join these people who are saturated in light. And as we move forward in a greater way, where more and more people are in the light, we will have a world that everyone wishes to live in. We will have a world where people enjoy their lives because love will surround them. We will have a world where there is peace, no more wars, a world that you would want to live in, a world that you would choose your friends and family, sons and daughters to live in. This is the world that I am preparing for you today. Amen. And so, um, it's quite incredible, isn't it, how many people he talks about the many people that are saturated in light and isn't that lovely to know because when we watch the news or, or read the newspaper it's often quite doom and gloom and there's a war here and, and arguments there or dis, you know terrible situations happening and we don't concentrate on the good things on on the things where people are tirelessly doing good in our world and that in a way is a shame that we just concentrate on the negativity because in it, it in a way it enlarges the negativity and I think that if we um, concentrated on the good things we would see just exactly what God is talking about there are more people that are good than not so thank you for watching and see you soon goodbye